so important to share this work. This work has changed my son's life. For parents of children with mobility issues, an increasingly popular motion therapy technique is offering them new hope. We'll explain coming up on CBC News. For parents of children with limited motor skills, finding the right therapy can be frustrating. Now there's a growing movement to adopt a motion therapy technique that focuses on the role of the brain. Today, the woman behind that method led a one-day seminar in Calgary. As Kate Adak reports, families say they need more access to the technique they call life-changing. Anat Baniel's therapy, she says, can help this little guy who has brain damage gain control of his spine. So I don't have to instruct a child with special needs how to move. I just have to create the conditions where the brain starts getting the information it needs via the movements we provide for them. She calls the approach ABM, named after herself. It's a neuromotor therapy for cases of brain damage or special needs. Oftentimes it was just pulled. Dan Ouellette's four-year-old couldn't use her arm until ABM. Then one day... She was putting her arm through the sleeve of something which she could have never done before. And she said to my wife, she said, uh, Mom, do you remember when I didn't have this arm? Nearly everyone here has been impacted by the technique. We're eager for Benielle to arrive from the U.S. Her method is hard to come by here. It's so important to share this work. This work has changed my son's life. It's changed my life. Hillary Mason is now one of only a few practitioners in the region. I went to every therapist that we had, every OT, PT, everyone, and I said, please, you've got to take this training. We need someone in Vancouver who can do this. And everyone said, no. <laughs> and I wrestled with that, and I said, well, then I'll do it. For now, those who can find help often have to pay out of pocket. That includes this workshop, which cost about $300. So that's, I think... The hardest part about it is that there's so many other people out there that it could be helping that maybe it's not accessible for them because of their geographical location or their financial situation. Many want to see greater health coverage. That's my life goal, to change that. To say, look, we have the evidence that this changes things for children. Organizers say there's currently only one qualified ABM practitioner in Alberta. Kate Adak, CBC News, Calgary. Muslims.